practical is it for the average Australian to own an electric car? With more, comedian, prospective EV owner and tonight's instant expert, Claire Hooper. <laughs> ready for electric cars. Oh, Charlie, we've been ready for over 100 years. This is absolutely true. By 1900, electric cars were all the rage, outnumbering petrol cars two to one in the US, and Australia loved them too. Like this little lady here about to do a ripper burnout <laughs> in her Baker electric runabout. Look at it. That's a smoother ride than my husband. <laughs> With Australia's proud history of electric cars, petrol prices through the roof, and the fact that I live in an inner city suburb that is competitively green, I would love to go electric, but it is impossible. Right, so, so what is stopping you, Claire? Well, first up, price. In 2008, the first Tesla debuted at 100 grand for this little midlife crisis pop top. <laughs> <laughs> and I thought that, like international phone calls, the price would have to come down heaps by now, but it still hasn't, and I still can't afford one. And I'm a TV star, Charlie. If I can't do it, <laughs> who can? <laughs> then there's the power. We were recently quoted 18 grand to upgrade our connection so we could charge an EV. <sighs> I could buy a whole other petrol car for that. <laughs> if you did solve the cost and the power problem, would that do it for you? Oh, no, Charlie, because Elon Musk. <laughs> Remember how cool Teslas were before we knew his personality? <laughs> <laughs> he's, <laughs> he's like an off-Broadway Bond villain. I can't, in good conscience, give my money to a guy who could be building a death laser on Mars. Do you think you will ever be going electric? Oh, I, uh, it looks like I'll have to get a few more years out of my 2009 Toyota Prius. <laughs> Hybrid. The mid-strength beer of electric cars. <laughs> Here's the old girl here, frankly, ready to be put out to pasture. <laughs> and the car's a bit run down too. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect for a TV star. You can catch Claire's new show at the Melbourne International Comedy Festival. Would you please thank TV star Claire Hooper? Yeah!